session is on STMI session, but my patient is of non-STMI, but as it is a uh, interesting case, that is why we have kept it. And uh, 70 years old gentleman, diabetic, hypertensive, CABC down 70 years, 17 years back, and CCS uh, three to four angina for few days, and on the day of the procedure, patient has severe chest pain, having raised troponin, and we send the patient to the uh, cath lab, and this is the scenario. The left, uh, left coronary system, left enter descending coronary artery, left circumflex coronary artery, all are 100% occluded. Right coronary artery, also 100% occluded, meaning that all the native vessels 100% occluded. Then Lima, uh, we could not negotiate the Lima, then uh, Lima absent, we can tell, or occluded. And only this is the vessel, only this is the vessel upon which the patient is surviving. And you see Lima is also <coughs> not predictable. May have very tiny Lima, but that is not uh, suitable or that is not uh, flowing uh, well to the left enter descending coronary artery. What will I do? Life is hanging in this tiny tunnel. Only a left enter descending coronary artery, left circumflex, that is OMs, and right coronary artery, all are dependent on this venous graft. This venous graft is connected with diagonal, through diagonal, it is uh, supplying the RCA, uh, left coronary artery, LED, and through LED, epicardial collaterals, RCA is fit. And so we became worried whether we shall touch it or not. I left the hospital and my uh, fellows uh, working in the institute called me that this is the scenario, patient has chest pain and th this is the only viable vessel and patient is on surviving this, what will you do? Then I come, came back and uh, procedure is easy, but to show that this can happen. Uh, I have taken one Jutkin's right catheter and you see catheter is also not engaged to the um, uh, origin of the uh, graft vessel, keeping uh, just closer to the origin of the um, uh, graft vessel, we uh, give two wires. We pass two wires as because my guide is not supporting how shall I do the work and that is why I have taken two PCI wires and then we have done pre-dilatation. I have to help Corona. All these are moving but I cannot see it. Next. Okay. Uh, pre-dilatation is in progress and after pre-dilatation we have taken a synergy on the right panel, uh, synergy 4 into 24, uh, not more than 4 is available in our hand uh, and stand deployment is in progress on the left panel, middle panel and this is the result after a stand deployment, post-dilatation with 5 into 8 millimeter balloon sequential three times post dilatation done and this is the result after post dilatation and you see here you can uh, predict that this venous graft is with diagonal and through diagonal LED is filled and through LED with the apical collaterals it is uh, supporting the uh, right coronary artery as well as it also supplies the uh, branches of the circumflex the, um, and the OMs. So we shall have to get uh, at the end of the tunnel, we can see the sun rising. Uh, thank you.